Well, howdy diddly dandy there, chums, does I, Captain of the Steves, and today, chums, for you guys, in the view of us, it's another sort of No Man's Sky video, and today I just wanted to talk about the reduxes, because they are coming to an end rather quickly, so Cartographers is now long in, and it's soon to end, yes, yeah, so I put the dates up on the screen, so you can see exactly when all these are going to come to fruition, so, on the screen are the actual dates for each of the expeditions. Cartographers is currently running, and it will be ending on the 29th of September. So I think we're going to be unlocking all of those ice statues before that actual date comes to its penultimate end. And then we're moving on to Voyagers on the 29th of December, which takes us through to the 8th of January, people. So yes, you might want to be hitting those ones up. Um, I'm probably not going to be running these. I haven't run Cartographers, and I very much doubt I'll be running Voyagers. I didn't really over enjoy the Voyager's expedition. I might do one just for tips and tricks to try and help people because it was. Although it wasn't the most enjoyable, it was one of the hardest as well. So I might do a tips and tricks depending on how things go. I'm not committing myself to that though, people in the view of us. If I do it, it's a bonus. And once they go into end, and then after they've ended, I believe we've got a bit more Quicksilver items left to go. So if I head on over to my screen over here, I should be able to bring on up exactly what's going to happen with the actual decals and everything else that's said to come into verse via the Quicksilver Merchant. Execute them on there! Chikaboom! Well there, uh, chums. I'm over on the No Man's Sky Assistant app. This is the web app. And if I hit on Community Mission, it's going to show the progress of what we currently have. Now, if I hit on Previous Mission Rewards, scroll on down to where we hit on up these ice statues. We've unlocked the Ice Astronaut statue. We're currently unlocked the Ice Blob statue and are working towards the Ice Gek statue. We then have the Ice Walker statue. I think we're going to unlock both of these before the next Community Mission starts. Why do I think that, people? Because the next section says Community Mission Research, which is for the last part of the Expedition Reduxes, which takes us into January. Then after that, we have these three decals to unlock. I don't think they're going to take overly long. I'm thinking five days for each of these, which gives us a rough estimate over this side of the screen. And then, scrolling up a little bit further, we've got three more ice statues. Again, I think these are going to take approximately three to, well, five to six days to unlock for these three, which takes us into sort of mid-February. I kind of feel that around this sort of date, we're probably going to see an update, along with perhaps the first expedition of the year, mid-Feb. We seem to get quite a lot of updates in February for the year, and it sort of sets the tone for the year. Yes, I, I kind of feel that we're not going to move on to these decals before we get the February update, unless I'm mistaken. If these go a lot quicker and we unlock all of these by mid-February, then of course, then we'll get the update. But that's all that's inside the Quicksilver store. So they have to put in an update to replenish the Quicksilver store at some point, early part of next year, people in the view of us. I know, chums. Well, that's pretty much what I think is going to be happening with all the sorts of decals and what's to come in to the verse inside of the Quicksilver Merchant store. Now, I believe Exo might have something that they wish to say. What are you going to got for us, little Exo? Captain, the new trailer that Hello Games put out into the iteration shows a new kind of ship. I feel that that ship could be a overhaul to the current iteration of Fighter. What do you think? Well, Exo, although that's quite a nice observation, inside of that trailer there are other fighters that are flying around, and they're pretty much in keeping to the previous type of fighter. So I don't think it's a new overhaul of fighter. I honestly think it's going to be a new class of ship coming into iteration, my little buddy. Yeah, so, no, I don't think that's... I don't think it is a new type of um, actual fighter. If it is, um, then, yeah, I'm, I'm completely wrong, but I thought that it could be a new racing ship. Or it could be a station ship. But, you know, when you look at class, station just doesn't really marry up. So I'm not 100% sure what's going on there, um, XO. But, yes, thanks for bringing that to our attention. 
Anyway, people, love to hear your thoughts and feelings on all of this. Please sound off inside of the comments. And yeah, I'd, I'd love to read them, to be fair, and find out what you guys think in the viewer bars. I guess, all of you. Yeah, brilliant, eh? Anyways, people, until next time, you've all been freaking awesome. Goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again.